What's up guys, Trex here, back with another episode of Trex Plays. This episode I'll be playing the wonderful game, Game Dev Tycoon. Uh, it's the Game Making Tycoon Simulator game. Um, and it's actually quite good fun. So, what we need to do is create our character and our level and our company. Hello there, it seems you've already played before. Yeah, I'll, I'll skip the tutorials because I've played it before. Welcome to Game Dev Tycoon. In this business simulation, you've been transported back in time to start your very own game development company right at the beginning of the PC revolution. In the next 35 years, you can build your dream company, create best-selling games, gain fans, and become the leader of the market. Alrighty. Before you can start your adventure, you have to give your upcoming company, company a name. Um, company name. George. Player name. I'm George. Okay, so let's make him male. Uh, let's give him red hair. And we're going to make him Ronald Weasley. So let's change his name to... Yeah, I'm going to keep it. I'm George. Okay, continue. Unlock hints? Yeah, I'd like to unlock hints. Oh, no. She's a safe slot. Um, That one. Yes, I want to overwrite that one. Alrighty, hello George, or yeah, you're George, and this is George. Everything is George. Really like that DeLorean right there, it's pretty cool. Um, let's create a new game, and we're going to call this game Pong, and you'll see why in a second. Pick topic Life, Evolution, Airplane, Post Apocalyptic. Well, I know which one I'm choosing Post Apocalyptic, Post -apocalyptic Pong. Genre, it'll be action. And the platform will be the PC. Alrighty, uh, text space or 2D graphics? Uh, let's do 2D graphics V1. There we go. Alrighty, so we shouldn't be getting those, uh, those little notifications up in this corner anymore. So, um, Pong, the engine needs to be important. The gameplay needs to be important. Action game, story doesn't really need to be that important. Let's do this. Let's, let's develop Pong. Uh, be sure to watch this right back here. So, um... Yeah, okay, we, we're getting some bubbles, and bubbles are really good. We want more bubbles so that we can make more bubbles with bigger, better, better bubbles to get more bubbles. Th this is a good game, I swear. Okay, so watch back there. Graphics, sound, world design, kind of important. Um, I'm, I'm flying through this, but y you adjust these sliders to, uh, make your game how you want it, what you want to focus on for whatever genre and topic it is. Oh, there we go, it's moving, Pong, see in the background, that's why we, that's why we named it Pong. Um, okay, any more points, any more bugs, no, okay, George, let's publish this, Pong. Alrighty, we did this. I'm George has leveled up. Or er, he's gained some more experience. Ooh, reviews. Sweet. What do you say about Pong? You give it a six. Action world game action games work well on the PC. I'm I'm reading. Okay. Has its moments, falls a bit short. And I like it. So 5.5. .5. That's that's okay. Um Let's generate a game report, I guess, of it. Game reports give us new research uh, research points up here so that we can develop more things. Okay, so the sales are going up. Ooh, we made it in the charts at number 67. We're actually selling it. We have 24 fans. Sweet. Okay. Yes, we're making our money now. Sweet, sweet. Uh, Post-release analysis. Okay, yeah. Whatever. 22 points. Let's research something. Let's research a new topic. Virtual pet. Yes. Let's do virtual pet. Ooh, and then we can do city and create simulation city. So it's not sim city, it's simulation city. Although sim does stand for simulation. So. Hmm. Oh, research complete. Virtual pet. Okay. Uh, research the thing for the thing so that we can do the thing. I'm. I, I, I make videos on the internet, can't you tell? 
Anyways, he is researching city. Um, this video is going to go up really late. I fell asleep this afternoon after soccer practice. Okay, we've researched city. Let's create a new game. Sweet. And we shall call it Simulation City. Pick the topic. It's a city one. Pick genre. Simulation. Or is it strategy? Strategy. Okay, yeah, let's go with strategy. PC. Here we go. Next. 2D graphics, that's what we want. Alrighty, Simulation City. Just so my voice doesn't go, I took a drink of water. Now we adjust these sliders the way we want them. I think that's good, so let's continue to the next stage. No, Pong's off the market. Alrighty, well then, okay. Okay, so gaining our design and technology points, but we did get some, uh, we did get some bugs. That's not too good, but we will fix those. George will fix those. Ooh, recent market market study suggests that the Gobbler G64 is steadily outselling competitors in the PC sector. Consider sector. Consumers prefer the lower price, greater availability, and the flexible hardware configuration over other home computers. Well, since I've played this game before, I'm not going to develop anything on this because pretty soon it goes out of business. Spoiler alert. Experts say that this might spell the end of the competing hardware manufacturers. Alrighty. So in the future, it does go bankrupt in like a year or two. Um, that's not really too much of a spoiler. Uh, but yeah so graphics are kind of important simulation city let's make this a good game that we can make sequels off of and load up with microtransactions and uh give it drm and yeah yeah okay let's finish the game okay uh it's finishing up simulation city we got a new record sweet Alrighty. so george got 117 experience uh, George, sell your DeLorean. That way we'll have more money. Simulation City. Ooh. Nine. Almost perfect. This is good. Uh, nine. Can't wait for the sequel. We'll give you a sequel. Nine. Great. Okay, if you give me an eight, I'm coming for you, old games. I'm coming for you. So uh, let's generate a game report on Simulation City. We have 17 research now, which is awesome. Okay, we've got 78.3k. Uh, according to rumors, the Japanese company Ninvento, wonder who that's a rip of, is planning to launch its very own home gaming console. Ninvento is known for the wildly successful arcade game Dinky King. Okay, wonder which game that could be. Many industry experts doubt that home gaming consoles will take off, but we are eager, eager to see what Ninvento will deliver. Alrighty, so um, Ninvento will be developing. A, uh, a new console. No new insights. Oh well. Um, let's research something. Can we research... These all look boring, especially romance. Let's just save it for a game engine. That would be good. Simulation City. Alright, it's doing well. Pick a topic. Let's do a life sim. Um, I'm just doing everything. I'm just creating the sims. The simulation... Okay, and we'll do it on the PC. Yeah, let's just do that. Okay, 2D graphics. Okay, Simulation City is still selling. Uh, engine, Story Quest. They gave me those choices, Live Sim and City Builder. What do you think I was going to do? What do you think I was going to do? Did you not expect me to do a rip of The Sims? Uh, okay. Artificial intelligence is key. Level design is not that key. The simulations, here we go. Um, simulation City, oh, it's rank 33. Stay in there. Uh, world design, we can put it out here. Sound, yeah, it's good. Alrighty, we're, we're doing good. We're actually running a company. How, how am I running a company? I don't know. It's very serious. The doctor says it could burst at any second. Oh well. Uh, Simulation City is off the market. Gave us 137,613 in sales. Ooh, Nintendo today Nintendo has confirmed recent rumors and announced their plans to release a new home gaming console called the Tez early next year. The console features cartridge-based games and a uniquely designed controller. Uh, the NES. That's what that's to take on, in case you didn't know that. 
Okay, here we go. Finish. Okay, there we go. Almost got another bug, probably, but we didn't. The simulations. New record on technology. That's good. Leveled up. Sweet. Let's see how the critics like it. The simulations. Um, and it's a nine. One of the best. And it's an eight. Love it. And it's an eight. Life simulation. And it's a seven. So we got an eight. Sweet. So they liked it. We shall make an entire franchise out of this. And instead of giving people the entire game, we shall make billions of DLC and expansion packs for them. Yes. Okay. So rank 18. Oh, contract work. Yeah, you get contracts after your third game. Uh, hi there. I've just finished the simulations. How, how can you finish it, Jason? I'm on to you. I've just finished the simulations, and I love your work. I'm in the contracting business, and we could use skills like yours. If you're ever short on cash, just let me know, and I'll see if I have some work for you. Jason. Sweet. Uh, we've almost got enough research for a game engine. So, um, make a report on the simulations. I'm George. Uh, how's George doing overall? We're doing pretty good with 271k, 364 fans. Alrighty. Um, just a few more research. No, okay. Graphics seems to be very, very important, and sound seems to be quite important. Alrighty, um, let's find some contract work. Library software done. Let's do this, George. Let's do this, George. You can do it. George, 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 Foreman, George, 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 do it. Stop scratch. Stop scratching your head. No, George. George, why? <sighs> Simulations, blah, 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 blah. Dang it, George. <sighs> you lost. Ah. Okay. Don't worry too much that I don't hold grudges. I don't care, Jason. Uh, find more contract work. Debug program. Spicy software. We can do that. Let's do this, George. Alrighty, we need two more research points so we can get that game engine. And that'll be awesome. One more. Oh, will he do it? No, he won't. Okay. Um. Find contract work debug program. I think we might be able to do this. Focus on the technology. Yes. Stop scrap. <sighs> Stop scratching your head, George. Ah, uh, we got our 50 research. That's all I care about. Alrighty, and the contract will expire. Although, ah, oh, we were so close. Um, let's develop. Let's research a custom game engine. Alrighty, we have one research point left over. And he's researching that. Sorry, I'm sniffling, guys. I still haven't fully recovered from my cold I had like two weeks ago. Don't know why. It's kind of weird. Um, 260k. So we've researched a custom game engine and we've made three games. So um, that was Game Dev Tycoon. It's quite a good little game. Um, I, I really recommend you pick it up. It's only $10 on Steam, I believe. So uh, if you'd like to pick it up, there will be a Steam link and a game developer site in the description. Um, it's quite beautiful, got quite nice sound. I really quite like it, actually. And so, um, yeah, so that was Game of Tycoon. If you liked the video, then be sure to like the video. And thank you for watching very, very much. And subscribe to my channel. It really helps out a lot. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.